Get ready for some real, relatable, and motivational conversations with podcast host Angela A. Love Lewis. Join her and her guests as they empower you to deal with the inner you so you can heal, believe, and lead yourself to the life of your dreams. It's time to take the limits off and experience true innovation. Let's get to it. Hello, 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 and welcome to Innervation, motivating you from the inside out. My name is Angela A. Love Lewis, and I am your host, and I'm so excited, as always, because each time I get a chance to have a guest on, I know that I'm going to not only give you value, but it's going to be something that's going to just help you in motivating yourself. Because, of course, you listen to people, you get the nuggets, you get the tips, tools, and strategies, but it all comes from motivating you from the inside so that that information can help you have an outward transformation. So my guest today is none other than Miss Carla Mukes. And Carla and I have had a really good history. We got connected during the pandemic. And I tell you, it's such a beautiful thing because although I know that COVID wreaked a lot of havoc on a lot of households, it also gave other people opportunities to pivot and to really step out into the digital space and really create uh, platforms and create opportunities to get their voices out there and make a difference, make an impact. And Carla Mutes is one of those people. So uh, I'm going to bring her on, but let me just say that Carla is an author. She's a speaker. She's a coach and she is the owner. She's uh, operated under coaching with Carla. So I want you all to give a virtual high five and hand claps for Miss Carla Mutes. Carla, how are you? I am fantastic. Thank you, Angela, for having me, girl. You know I always love my girl time with you. Yes. I'm so excited to talk to you today because I know that, you know, we've had a recent conversation and in the conversation, just to let the audience know, uh, Carl is one of those people who can just really take a look at what you're doing and really help you to elevate to the next level. And so, you know, we connected and she was sharing some things and I felt like this is such great information for my audience because when we're out here in the digital space, y'all know we're being social on uh, Facebook and we're, you know, doing the IG thing and Twitter and LinkedIn and all these different platforms. And you see people who are making a difference and they're, you know, influencers or they're out here impacting. But at the end of the day, we want to talk about the value that they bring. But before we get into it, Carla, I just gave them a little taste of who you are, but can you please just add a little bit more to it and let them know something about you? Okay, well, thank you. I'm Carla Mitz. Um, I live in Edmond, Oklahoma, and um, I'm a wife. Of, you know, we've been married a little over 32 years, and um, I have three kids, three adult kids, and I've always been an entrepreneur at my core and at my spirit. I love to see uh, independent workers grow and help other people. So although I was a stay-at-home mom, entrepreneurship has always been the core of who I've always been. So when I say that, I, I've had those opportunities because we were a military family where I've always had to do, I always did the side hustle. And my side hustle was the entrepreneurial part where I've been in Mary Kay, Pimper Chef. But whatever I was doing, I tried to do it at my best, at my excellence. But one of the things that I started noticing is that I love to see people would say, how did you do that? And I love to pour that into other people. So basically, when the pandemic hit, it changed my field. And I just started coaching. People started asking me questions. And, you know, it's just a God thing that I know the answer. Cause you know, sometimes you can just, sometimes some, some people are doers and then some people are coaches and they help you walk along. You take Michael Jordan, you take Will Smith, you take all these famous people and uh, entrepreneurs, they have coaches and uh, people who walk alongside. So what I do and what I've done for my family, for my friends, is I walk alongside them to help them get through the process that they are working on. That's good. That's good. And like you said, when you talk about, you know, these heavy hitters with 
Will Smith or Michael Jordan, you know, and, and just kind of helping people, knowing that people need someone to kind of help them along the process, you know, to get to the next level. And there's so much raw talent out here. And, you know, I believe that God gives each one of us gifts and talents. But for some people to achieve a level of greatness, they are needing someone to give them that extra push. That's why, you know, you see people with coaches or you see people with trainers because they're trying to hone that gift and take it to the next level. And so you do it so well. You are such a, you know, uh, a great person to provide insight and to see something that maybe somebody else, you know, in their blind spot can't catch. But let's talk about, you know, connecting and really serving when we're out here in these digital streets trying to make some things happen. I want you to kind of share with people uh, a ways to, you know, kind of brand and, and, and do some things. Because, again, when we talk about networking, it really is about building relationships. But how do people connect and serve each other? Well, yeah, thank you for asking, Angela. One of the things that, um, this is what happened. I saw Angela getting ready to put some information out there, and I was like, hey, you know, right now I'm not ready, but look, I am going to do these actions. And these are the actions that when I'm in a group of networking ladies or powerhouse ladies and my friends, I may not, it may not be all about me. It's going to be me serving somebody else. So I want to encourage you that when you're out there, looking at that information, let's do something with it. Let's push our family and friends and business owners to the next level by doing some of these things. I have nine. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on them, get the uh, recording and go back over them. But when we're looking at information, the least we can do, the number one thing that we can least do, like it. Because then they let, that, that helps their algorithm on any kind of platform say that, oh, somebody's paying attention to it. So let's at least acknowledge each other and say, like heart, like a heart that posts. The next thing, number two, is the least is comment. And you know what? The digital platform is so smart. Sometimes all you got to do is push it, and it'll come up automatically what to say. You can add to it, add a face to it, but add at least three words, three to four words, and that helps their algorithms. And Facebook and Instagram, it says, oh, people are looking at this, and so it keeps it up high on the post. So I'm just saying, you know, if you see somebody out there hustling and working hard, ladies, let's, let's help them out. Um, number three. Well, wait a minute, Colin, before post. you go to number three, let me say this. Let's go back to those two because – yeah. That's not hard. I mean, you know, a lot of times not people hard. just, it's not hard at all to like it and to comment on it because like you said, Facebook has made it especially so easy that all you got to do is touch the screen and the stuff and it automatically pops up potential comments that you can make. And so that is such a wonderful way to, you know, tell people that help somebody else to, you know, get the visibility because it really is about visibility. When you are, uh, out here trying to get your product, your brand, your service, when you're out here trying to, you know, make yourself known and visible, these little two simple things can really change the trajectory of somebody's business and make them more credible because they are more visible. Yes. One of the things that I've noticed that even when I'm not promoting something, I try to promote other people. And because I'm consistent, it helps keep their algorithm up. So you may be somebody who always comments, and so then I'll see it, and then it'll go over to somebody else's page, and it'll share to somebody else's, because that is an algorithm. We are not in control of it, so we need to contribute as much as we can. And look, ladies, we out here hustling hard, and it is not always, we're always so self-conscious about our posts and our people seeing it. You can help that happen just by simply doing those two, those are the two most common things. But if you're in a special group, and I know, like, I know how amazing Angela is, and I know how hard this girl is out here working, trying to empower women and encourage people, no matter what, if I see it, I stop and I take, if that's, if that's the only one I do, but it's not, I make sure. I, I say comment, hey, see you, awesome, you look amazing, uh, keep up the good work. Say something. Share it with somebody else. The next one, Angela, is share their post. So okay. if, you're, if you can share it to another group, you can share it on your page, or if you can share message it to somebody else that also helps them keep their posts up and alive. So just just be very conscious, you know, that if you can just in a second 
like and share, comment and share. Those things people say it all the time, but it really does mean a lot. The other thing you can do is tag a friend. You know, like when I'm talking to somebody and I see something like Angela and I see something that she can build on, I send it to her. But that also, that helps her, that helps the person who, who did the information, and it helps also spread out the audience. So hmm. also tag a friend. Go in there and put that person, if you start typing their name, it'll come up. All you got to do is push it, and that's how you share it. Okay? Girl, so they make, make it make easy habit. for you. Girl, they're making it so easy. They, you, you can just tag it and, and just say, Angela, check this out. You know, love this. You know, just put a couple of words. You don't even have to put a couple words. Even if you just tag that person, it'll go to them. And um, it really does help them to do this. I mean, we just have to work with the system. And so that's one of the major things. Now, so, that you said a word right there, Carla, working with the system. And, you know, I think that for a lot of people, when they miss the fact of thinking, of understanding that we want to help support each other. But it's so many people out here doing things. I know that you can't financially go and buy everybody's product or, you know, take advantage of everybody's service. But we're telling you ways that you can go out here and support your fellow business owners by helping them, you know, or people who are out here trying to build themselves with their brand to be in front of other people. This is a no cost effort. It doesn't take you anything but a little time. And it's not a lot of time. It's a very small amount because again, the system is already predisposed to putting things out there for you to make it simple. Like she said, if you're commenting, Nine times out of 10, a comment is already going to pre-populate. If you're tagging, all you got to do is start typing their name and it's probably going to pop up and you just select it and then enter. So it's, it's, it's already there for us to design and make it easy. And all we have to do is invest just a little time to help make somebody else's uh, experience better and get them out there in front of more people. So I love it. I right. love the information. Yeah, sure. And, and that's, that's all the free things. But I'm gonna, I ain't going to leave nothing out today. At the Come end of the day, purchase. Come on now. Purchase. Be a part of it. Get a book. Get, I mean, you know, or send it to somebody who you know who could use that service. Share that information. Say, this is the book. This is the look. This is the, this is the uh, coordinator. This is the author. This is the publishing company. I mean, I go to my events. I'm not a publishing company, but I've done a book. But I always carry Angela's information. Hey. Go to A and M uh, Publishing. This is who you need to talk to, right? So now you know we're getting into the purchase, purchase side of it, mm -hmm. and that that is so valuable. If it's not you, then who do you know? You know what I'm saying? Like, let that's really adding value. The when you bless somebody else, trust you are storing up blessings for yourself. So yes. go if from the inside to the outside, like Angela was talking about. You know, like I said, it may not be your season to purchase, but there may be somebody else. It may be your boss. It may be your cousin. It may be the neighbor. It could be the teacher. You know, just look at that. Look at the information and, and store it so that it's a resource for whoever you may come across. God, God may send somebody your way. You'd be like, I don't even know why God says it. Oh, it's for you. And you're, you're there and you're prepared for that information. So don't just look at, oh, I don't need it. No, look and see who else might need it. Okay, so that's one. That's one of the other things. The other thing is, is give feedback. You know, if you can't purchase, hey, this is a great book. This is a great author. Hey, in those chapters, that's one thing about Angela. Some of the books that I have done with her, and she has done, there's stories that uh, impact the people. I read this book about women empowerment. There's a lady in there. She talked about, the, you know, whatever the topic is. You need to get this book. So give feedback. You can give a review. All of those things are being used, and we need that for content for other things. So don't be afraid to give some feedback. Now, I gave That's Angela good. some feedback, but I called her, and I was like, girl, look, don't leave me out. I'm not doing this project right now, but you know what? If you can invite me and I'm available, I'd love to participate. And, you know, sometimes they just need people to come into the space and have a warm space or a smile. So, like I said, sometimes it's not about what you're doing, but let's go bless some more people by just showing up sometimes. That's a real good thing. Give feedback, show up. Girl, that's um, great right there, Carla. 
feedback because everybody, sometimes people need to know how they're positioning themselves, how they look to other people, whether or not somebody's getting something. And again, that is the, the value that you can bring and help serve someone else to let them know how they're doing. I know that uh, a lot of times when we're writing books, you can go on to Amazon and do reviews. If you're on Facebook, you can actually go do, do reviews for their business or their service. And so those are great things that can really help. And the thing about it is some people are very quick to give negative reviews, but though there are a lot of people who have had great experiences, but fail to go back and, you know, really share how amazing it was. And sometimes some people are really, that's how they get their information. They're scrolling through trying to find someone with great re reviews so that they can, you know, maybe go to the Airbnb or try the restaurant or whatever it is. They're looking for reviews and feedback so they know whether or not it's someone that they need to invest in as well. So girl, you on fire with this. These tips, I'm telling you, I love it. I love it. What you got for us next? Hi, my name is Angela Lewis, and I am the editor-in-chief of iShine Magazine and host of iShine Podcast. And I come to you now to tell you about an amazing partnership we have with Ad Voices. Yes, we are bringing you next-level, tailor-made audio and video advertisements that can get you in front of the masses. We want to be able to help you showcase your business, get it inside iShine Magazine, and on various podcasts. That's right your very own commercial and the bonus is you get to keep the content to showcase on your website as well as your social media platforms you cannot beat that we want to help you level up in 2022 so join us visit us at www.getvisibilitynow.com and then we will help you to get tailor-made plans that will fit your budget and help you to make an impact like no other so join us we look forward to connecting with you So, girl, you on fire with these tips. I'm telling you, I love it. I love it. What you got for us next? Girl, I, my last one is buy again. Start over. You know, start at the top. Like, comment, save their post, share their post, tag a friend, purchase, give feedback, post a review, and do it again. I mean, so many times, I, I, I and I have been guilty. I'm calling myself out. You know, I sit there and I look and I'm scrolling. And I was like, why didn't I like that? Why didn't I, you know, at least give some feedback? Hey, that's a pretty picture. Hey, I like the uh, content uh, of that post. They are basically giving you words to, to give them feedback. And so why don't we do it? Well, we're, we're just mindlessly scrolling through. And there's nothing wrong with that because it can be like a, a, a stress reliever. Or de, you know, you just debriefing for the day. But add some value to somebody else. How can I add value? How can I like like two or three of those posts, share two or three of those posts, uh, comment on two or three of those posts? Just spread the love out and uh, let's help each other grow and uh, become the entrepreneurs that they're desiring to be. And, and like I said, it's, it's really simple to just sit there, but let's get active. 2022 is my, is my year of double blessings, and I want to see everybody win at a very high level. So in order to do that, I have to give of myself and give in a way. It's not costing me to share and like and comment. It's not going to cost me a thing. So I'm, I just really wanted to encourage you. I know Angela is always giving, and I wanted to give her a word of encouragement because, honey, she's one of the hardest working women out here. She's getting it done. <laughs> She help, she's helping, you know, entrepreneurs develop their voices, publish their books. And this is a part that if you have a book or somebody is putting a book out there, share, like, and comment. All those things matter. And, you know, the devil wants to kill, steal, and destroy, and they're like, oh, nobody's looking or listening. Yeah, we look and listen, but we're just not doing our part. So my challenge for you guys, you know, is, hey, come on, y'all. Let's start liking, commenting and saving their posts and sharing it so they can go out and bless these people. Uh, That's all I got, girl. 
Come on, Carla Mukes. Listen, that's why she's coaching with Carla because she is bringing the nuggets, the tips and tools that can help you to help other people or that you can share with your uh, tribe on how they can help you to continue to elevate. Because at the end of the day, you don't know how many people get discouraged because no one likes what they're doing, you know? And of course you're not doing it just for likes, but at the end of the day, people want encouragement. They want feedback. They want to know that you're liking what they are putting out there. And you don't want somebody who you're getting value from to not stay in business because they don't get the uh, visibility they need to be credible so that they can become profitable. So we want to make sure we do our part, especially for people that we know are out here really doing a great thing. You know, there's nothing wrong with being able to like a post about, you know, what they're sharing with their uh, vision, what they're talking about. There's nothing wrong with that. Then you want to be able to comment and then share it or tag a friend. Again, if you can purchase, but like Carla said, give the feedback. Do those things that are going to really help to have them stand out. Post a review and then guess what? Do it all over again because you're already on the platform. You're already on social media. So if you're there, you might as well, you know, make it worth your while by connecting and serving someone else through giving the value. Carla, I'm so excited because this is just giving me a renewed um, thought process to go in and really look at some things that my friends are sharing and make sure that I am being responsible as well because it takes a village out here. Yes, girl, it does. It really does. And, you know, like when you start out, it takes a little bit of time. Don't be so hard on yourself, you know, that you don't see it. It's out there, but I'm just trying to give you the inside tip of how these platforms work. You know, just a small acknowledgement or, you know, like even if you can put some emojis, it's counting them, they just go up, they count more if you were write words, people will look at it more and it helps you. So when you get ready to do your project, when Angela or I come across yours, you'll be like, oh, you know what, oh, she's doing something. So we're gonna give you the same love. So the Bible says, do unto others that they would have them do unto you. You go out here and, and do that. And when it's your time, I promise you'll be blessed too. Yes, honey, be blessed to be a blessing. I love it. I love it. I love it. Listen, Carla, you have really just came in and truly blessed me as well as I'm sure everyone who is listening to the podcast. And again, when you motivate yourself from the inside out, one of the key things is being able to help somebody else. And this is just really a great strategic, intentional way of being of service to, you know, all the people that are in your circle that are business owners who are out here, you know, trying to make a difference. And so again, I'm so grateful for you. I know that you are just always doing your thing. You're always positioning yourself, you and your husband to make an impact on all that you guys do individually and together. So I'm just glad you took some time out to come and share with me and my group and give us these tips and tools to help us to become even better. Carla, how well, can people you, connect with you? You can connect with me on uh, Facebook. And on Facebook, I ha also have my Calendly. If you would like to have, uh, you know, if you'd like to have a coaching session, you can uh, always contact me. I always like to hear people's information to see how I can see if there's a way to help you go further in what you do. And then we also put uh, information out on our I Am Will. We do couples counseling. He's a licensed marriage and family therapist. So we'll be putting the information out there. But you can connect with me on Facebook or and then on Facebook you can look for my calendar and uh, connect and make an appointment if you like. Awesome, awesome. And Carla, before we end the call, please uh, share one more final thought with the audience. Anything you would like to leave them with? Go out and be a blessing. Let's go bless more people. It doesn't cost anybody. Sometimes a blessing can be free. And that comes in supporting other people. And so when you bless other people, the blessings are, are on the way to you. So let's go bless more people.
Hey, that is it. And I think it's such a beautiful sentiment, you know, for 2022. Make it a year where you are blessing others. Uh, we had a call earlier today uh, with a lady, Dr. Pamela Brown, and she was saying that when you see that God has blessed someone, you know, trust and believe he's still in your neighborhood. So there's blessings coming to you. So I love it. I love it. I thought that was just amazing. And uh, I think that it's a great mantra to have, a great motto to live your life by, to be a blessing to somebody else. So Carla Mukes, thank you so much for being here again. I am so excited. Again, this is Innovation, the podcast motivating you from the inside out. Please do what Carla said for this one. Like it, share, comment. Hey, subscribe, because I tell you, it's going to make a huge difference to getting us out there where more people can hear this content, where they can tap in to people who can give them value as well. And hopefully it's been valuable for you. So again, I'm your host, Angela A. Love. Lewis, you have been listening to my guest, Miss Carla Mukes of Coaching with Carla. Please reach out and connect. We would love to work with you further. All right, you guys have a phenomenal rest of the day. Bye.